Okay, so we are ready for pages 184 and 185. Okay, so go ahead and follow along with me as I read. And again, you can read along if you would like to. A dunk, you know, a slam, a jam, to throw it down. You jump and put the ball in the rim while holding onto it. Oh, that, she said, trying to hide the fact that she had never heard of it before. See, what you do is you dribble the ball, jump up, and put the ball in the rim with your hand, said a kid with the Lakers jersey on, trying to demonstrate how the ground, on the ground as best he could. You guys, can we finish this game? It's getting dark and my mom wants me home soon, TJ said, still upset that Joe was getting all the attention and that his shot was blocked. Okay, so how do we see um, TJ is still feeling about this whole um, Joe, um, her getting all the praise, right? And he's kind of on the back burner now. So how do we think TJ feels about feels right now about it? He's saying, come on, guys, let's go home. Okay, um, I need to get home because my mom says I need to get home before it's dark. How does he feel? How do you think he's feeling with all this going on? I would say, again, he's feeling very jealous of her. Okay, so maybe jealous that she's getting a lot more attention now than what he, he is. Um, and maybe still embarrassed from before and her blocking that ball from him. Okay, let's uh, go ahead and keep reading. Hold your horses, TJ, said the freckle-faced kid. I want to see jo Joe dunk again. I'll bet that he can dunk it better than Michael can. Now remember, Michael is still Michael Jordan, that famous basketball player. Well, I'll give it a shot, Joe said, curious herself to see if she could dunk. She started at half court, dribbled the ball quickly, and headed straight for the rim. As she approached, she remembered how high her basket was and realized that this one was much lower. So don't you think it's going to be probably a lot easier for her to get this in the rim? Maybe she could jump a little further and dunk the ball through. As she got to the free throw line, she lifted her left leg up and went flying into the air till she was so high, she looked down on the hoop. Now... All she had to do was put the ball in the rim with both hands. Okay, so we talked about how TJ was feeling um, before she went into this, she went and tried to dunk, right? How do you think he's feeling now um, that she's getting ready to dunk? So as she's going up to the basket, as she's running up to the basket to try, try to dunk this ball, how do you think he's feeling? Maybe he's feeling a little anxious, maybe... He's like, oh, like, please don't let this girl or this boy, he thinks she's a boy. Please don't let this boy make this basket, okay? Because he maybe wants a little bit more attention. Um, so maybe he's feeling a little bit anxious or maybe he's like, oh, what's going to happen? Okay, something like that. So do you think she's going to make this ball in this basket? Make a slam dunk? We'll see. Um, we're, we're on page 185. We'll see what what happens. She was up there for a while before she felt her hands on the rim. So she did get to the rim, the ball going through and her feet touching the ground. When she landed, all the boys' mouths were hanging open and for a moment they were speechless. Okay, so speechless meaning they couldn't talk. They were so surprised that they couldn't say anything. They couldn't think of anything to say. Why do you think they were surprised? Why do you think they were that surprised? Do you think it's because she made this ball into the into the net. She dunked the ball. We'll have to see. Go ahead and turn to the next two pages and we will continue reading.